I'm an addict for sneakers, 20s of Buddha and bitches with beepers in the streets I could reach her about Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Nature Below G. Often imitated, never duplicated. Bring you the best on feats in the game! Yo, so first things first, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, ring the hell of that notification bell so you can stay in tune with all the fire that I got coming. It really helps the channel. I don't know why you ain't ringing that bell. Let's go ahead and get this fire going, yo. First things first. So, this review is coming a little bit later than I wanted it to. Now, I already had the shoe. I just wasn't able to get in contact with my plug to go pick my pair up. So I ended up getting another pair and that pair ended up coming in. So now I'm at two pairs of these joints and you already know what I'm talking about. I'm talking about these right here. Boom! Yo, the boy got two boxes. I can't really hold them. You already see it. That gold on the back. That black at the bottom. You know what time it is. Yo, your boy got them DMP sixes. Now I got uh, one size nine and one size nine and a half to figure out what size I like better. I already know what time it is. It's gonna be that size nine. These joints right here, these joints right here are fire. Hold on, I gotta show y'all the shoes. Boom, yo, the gold DMC. <laughs> the gold, black and gold. <laughs> The black and gold DMPs, yo, I'm so happy to have these in my collection. I actually have the, the pack that released back, I want to say in 2000, I don't know if it was like 13 or 14. Anyway, it was a pack that released back then. They had a black and gold pair of sevens and a white and gold pair of sixes. Yo, those was like crazy at the time you know what i mean i do have that pack but my sevens got beat up and so i got them out of there but it would have been dope if they did a black and gold six with that white and gold six so much fire and you already know that the six is my favorite silhouette anyway let's go ahead let's take this to the table look at the details i know you guys probably seen reviews between seeing my review and you might learn something that they didn't tell you in the last review let's go ahead take it to the table right about now boom back to the table so we got this black and gold dmp6 originally this did come inside this shoe here did come inside of a pack it came in a pack the dmp pack with the uh the um the finding moments package with the uh jordan 11 they had that uh that gold uh that gold situation right there now i am curious are they gone since they retro this pair are they going to retro the concord 11s with that gold joint on there so that you can put it together it won't be the exact pack like you had before but it would be a pack but let's go ahead let's talk about these details of the shoe so obviously you got that gold right here translucent sole here black hits right here on the bottom got that gold jump man you got this tag i put the tag here it wasn't on here but it does say air jordan uh june 12 1991 defining moments mj's first professional championship so you know he had these sixes on when he won that championship on the back you got that gold situation right here you know what I'm talking about? That's kind of fire. You got that hit of gold right there where it says 23. Uh, inside the shoe, it does have the Jumpman in there, but it does say uh, 2020. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me see if I can focus that in for you. So right down there, it does say uh, 2020. So yeah, um, here in the front of the tongue, you got that Jumpman here, Jumpman on the lace lock. Don't have no hits of Nike anywhere on there. Um, you got Jordan, Jumpman, I mean Air, Jordan right there on the tongue bro only thing that I'm worried about with this shoe yo it's no hits of 3m in here like what's really good with that is that how it was on the original pair I'm not sure if somebody knows down below please leave a comment down below let me know did it have 3m and the OG and the OG pair that came inside the pack. Also, I wonder why did they put 2020 inside on the uh, insole inside the shoe? You know, that's something right there. So if anybody knows that, go ahead and let me know. Help educate the young OG. You know what I'm saying? Put me on game, because I definitely didn't get these back in the day. You know what I'm talking about? Yo, this shoe is crazy. Man, I love it, I love it, I love it. I'm definitely gonna be keeping a pair in the collection. Even though I got a double up, I'm definitely probably gonna sell that one pair and hopefully I can use that pair to pick up another OG kick that I like, you know what I'm saying? Because right now is the time to try to go back and get some of them OG pairs that people, are, that, you know, people sleep on. You know, once the hype started dying down, you know, people be forgetting like, you know, they just let shit go, you know what I mean? Let things go and 
you know, those people ain't real sneakerheads, no way. They just here for the hype. You know what I'm saying? I'm here for the I'm here for the long haul. You know what I mean? But let's go ahead, take these joints on feed. You can tell me what you think about them on feed. You know what I'm saying? Tell me how you, if you rocking with them or not. Let's go ahead and go. Let's do that right about now. Let's go. So what you feeling that on feet? Are you gonna be going ahead picking up your pair? You know what I'm saying? Again, yo, I think this shoe is like pretty fire. Um, the whole thing about the shoe is that, like I said, it doesn't have that 3M in there. Um, I don't know why they didn't put it there. And I, I don't know if it wasn't there in the OG pair. You know what I'm saying? Because I know you're trying to keep things like OG and everything. But why not? Why not put that 3M in there? You know what I'm saying? I mean, I think it's fire. Not like it's a really big difference. You only really can see that at nighttime. And you get a few hits of it in the daytime. But I really would have liked for them to put that 3M in there. Uh, this pair actually came, the pair that I actually bought that didn't come from the plug came from Finish Line. Yeah, I don't know, man. Like, like I say, I like the shoe. If I had to rate the shoe itself uh, 1 out of 10, Yo, this is a strong eight for me. And it's a nine for me, man. Yo, this shoe is a strong nine for me, more or less because I am a Jordan 6 fan. So the Jordan 6 is my favorite silhouette. So obviously I'm rocking with that. And yo, it's the closest thing you're gonna get to getting that pack ever. You know what I mean? I can live without the Jordan 11. The Jordan 11 is not my favorite Jordan silhouette. You know what I mean? Some people will say that's blasphemous. Uh, I disagree. So, um, yeah, I mean, that part. Uh, yo, so tell me what you think. Did you get you a pair? Um, yeah, that's it. Leaving you with some positive feedback to end this video. You know what I'm saying? Um, what, can, what can I say that's like real positive? You know what I'm saying? All right. So here's, here's, here's that positive feedback, yo. Nothing in this world is impossible. Nobody, no matter what nobody says to you, you have to know that nothing is impossible. If you look at the word itself, it says, I'm possible. You know what I mean? Nothing's impossible. Everything's possible. Don't stop grinding. Don't stop working. Put in that work. You see me, right? You ain't never seen me put up this many videos like this, and maybe once or twice. And you ain't, I, I feel, I ain't perfect. I'm just trying to be a little bit more consistent. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get up out of here, cause now I'm doing too much. Thanks for rocking with the kid. Thanks for watching my videos. Like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate y'all for rocking with me. We are doing that giveaway once we reach 2,000 subscribers. It is what it is. Thanks for rocking with me. Uh, I, I rock with y'all. Holla at y'all next time. Peace.